if you have metaphysical problems and no one else can help and you have jumper cables maybe you can hire the fail boat Red Shoulder Hawk and the little Mexican burrowing owl. It was so cool. Today, our technical issues continue. If Somehow, <laughs> we managed to pull this off, so we got Dave stranded too. <laughs> Don't be pissing off the fail boat. <laughs> She's pissed enough to sit in. Princess has to get us home. No, no. She has been recommissioned the fail boat. She can be Princess Fail Boat. <laughs> <laughs> Fair enough, I love you, but. But, as far as places to get stranded go. It is kind of a nice place to get stranded. As you can see, there are definite entertainment options here. <laughs> like breaking into JC Penney's and raiding it or what? Get back in there, you! Oh, sorry! Oh. 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 Worst fake orgasm ever. Please put okay, a little bit of enthusiasm. <laughs> Next time I hire Meg Bryant. Shit, she got it right the first time. I got to get a little Oh, yeah. It's been a while since I've been in a vehicle that rocked whenever anybody got in. <laughs> when the vehicles are rocking, don't come and knock unless you're hot. Oh, man. Whose food am I going to rock? Hmm? Whose food am I going to rock? No, mine's right here. And that's what? I'm not going to Actually, you can have some of mine if you want. No, no, I am. Did we go through all the coats? Uh, there's a few left in the freezer part. You need to take screw out up there. Top the freezer part. Gary's basically very upset because he doesn't want to leave. The presence of the Brandon and Amber, and the Ashley as well. I've been trying to say that all damn day. Thank you. What are you looking mm -hmm. for? And he's been oh, very frustrated, and it's just kind of bubbled up. There's a bug, and it buzzed. And I want to make sure it's not a wasp. Because me and them do not get along. Actually, lately they have been getting along with you. They just gotta chill out. It's just a well, yeah. Oh, okay. No, they really get along with me well. They land on me and crawl in my hair and crawl on my face and try to land on my hands while I'm writing. Master Joe, would you happen to have any? Uh, yes, Master. Master Joe, would you happen to have any <laughs> can openers? Not handy. Use the side of the table if you need. Use the ashtray. And I tried that. Ashes fell. That's out. Why did we close the door? It was ventilation. Because I didn't know it was ventilation, that's why. <laughs> Screw it. You are such okay. novices to the whole trailer experience. <laughs> this is my first time. Travel trailer. Whoa, whoa, whoa! <laughs> Let's see if I can remember the whole thing my sister does. Happy llama, sad llama, mentally disturbed llama. <laughs> this is drama llama, mama llama, duck, 
Goose, moose, and then finally is my favorite. Whenever there's an awkward situation and you find yourself there's an awkward silence, you just go, awkward turtle. <laughs> and your feathers and your ill ability to stay in my fucking hair. I just see a sea turtle gently floating through space. Swimming. Did you get it? <laughs> you know, I have burned. Uh, not so cold uh, water. Not the whole mm. <laughs> <laughs> oh, All right, genius pants. You do it. Thank you, Chuck. <laughs> hey, Teddy. What's your problem? <laughs> you have some issues? <laughs> I always have issues. <laughs> What's wrong, Dave? Why can't you get it? It's so easy, Dave! Come on, Dave! Come on, Dave! What's the problem, Dave? Did you just bend the ashtray? No, no, but I just realized this metal is not nearly as strong as I thought it was. <laughs> just use the end of the table. I still look for it, that's right. <laughs> yeah, I used to know how to do this. Put the top on there. Wait, wait, this is not a strong table. I don't have any tools in the purse. I don't have any tools on me other than a recorder, which I am not using. Open this. Let me see that. That's wood. You're going to destroy this is wood? Yes. This metal thing right here is wood? <laughs> oh, that is metal. <laughs> <laughs> I thought you were talking about Take the piece of wood. Take out the right? retardation. <laughs> I'm not getting yeah, it. You spill alcohol all over you. I will laugh. <laughs> It is not really that important. Just put it there down. By the time we are done. Maybe I'll just have a corona by osmosis. Maybe we'll do it that way. He can lick it off my hand. No. Why would an ashtray not have a bottle opener? Because it's an ashtray, not a bottle opener. And we normally don't pop tops on cigarettes. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, normally the lack of cigarettes calls you to pop a top. There you go. Now, can you imagine for how many years this was almost every weekend? Wow. <laughs> I mean, you know, why not? I'm tired of waiting for this. I'm going to need my corona and eat it now. <laughs> so, I'm going to grab my tool. Don't you have a knife or something? You're an EMT. You should have a, a metal object of some kind. Not on my person. I have a knife on my person. A is. knife is a flat metal object. I can perhaps open this. You want to use that to pop on a bottle and then break the knife. <laughs> you should have seen Brennan. He found a way to use needle nose pliers. <laughs> Maybe we just stab a hole. Or was it a monkey? <laughs> Let's just find a way to stab a hole in the top of the cap and just drink it like a sippy bottle. <laughs> Read a crazy straw! Tip of the day, don't buy stuff that needs a bottle opener if you don't have a bottle opener. <laughs> yeah, you can use, uh, usually I... Slaws? No. And a bottle opener. Why didn't you just think of that in the first time? Ah! <laughs> <laughs> that's just fail blow. It's going to fail field. <laughs> Well, y'all really? thought you could do it, and I just wanted to see. I just wanted to wait and see what was happening. No, Amber, is this enough to convince you to smudge my RV? <laughs> <laughs> I can smudge you. My maybe you shorter. You know, be very careful with that. I once purified an old vehicle, and all the parts that were just about to break broke all at once. Yeah. I maybe putting God's bless this camper didn't really help much. <laughs> Because I put a protection room over there, and it wasn't a gift of the gods over here. I don't think it worked. <coughs> well, it was owned by well, so the... So far you haven't gotten beat up or robbed or anything, or carjacked, and or... You know what? Why don't we just add to the list of all the <laughs> things that could happen, Dave? Just to As make everybody feel better. the vehicle takes off different things mm. it can do. <laughs> See, this RV has been very well protected. <laughs> by its inability to go anywhere. <laughs> If they, 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 they kidnap us, you are Ellie's new mommy. 
They will... If they kidnap us, she ain't gonna be around either. Don't let her go. I wish I knew more of the lyrics, but that's the only thing I got. And this is our college years 24 7, because we never really did not hang out. It was we were as mobile as this vehicle. <laughs> Trying to remind me of Ace Bowl. <laughs> <coughs> and my tiny little house. You're converting a rod. <laughs> that had the monuments of Venice Beauty. <laughs> they had the what? <laughs> my friend Savvy is about four foot tall. You remember mm -hmm. Walter? That she was telling you about Walter? Yeah. Yeah, but so, Savvy's really, really, really fucking Sammy. hot. She well, is. Yeah. But she's also really fucking crazy. Yeah, yeah, but that's part of the experience, okay? That is part of the Savvy basically says you have 15 seconds to impress her, and after that, she decides whether she's you're willing to talk to her or not, or she's willing to talk to you. And you don't. I was an arrogant prick. <laughs> so, Savvy, when Walter would ask, Miss Savannah, Savvy, what do you want for your birthday? Monument to my beauty! And Walter said, no, seriously. What, the, what do you want for your birthday? I want a monument to my beauty! To my beauty! So, Walter got a lot of plywood. And he made a fucking <laughs> obelisk <laughs> that was six feet tall. <laughs> he never left it there when she moved. <laughs> he stopped it in my little converted garage in my apartment. He's like, Did he can I keep this here? It? Hmm? Did he put stuff on it? Were there symbols on it? I can't remember. No, he didn't get past the plywood part because Savvy took up most of his time. Time for Savvy? Time for Savvy! Is time for Savvy now? She would literally, like, straddle over him between him and his laptop and be like, It's Savvy time! Time for Savvy! She's a fucking house cat. <laughs> no, I think this goes beyond house cat. It's a savvy cat. Wow. I gotta meet her. It's a Savannah cat. I need to meet her. I'm not sure that's a good idea. <laughs> this one's been described. Meeting Savvy? Yeah. Savvy's pretty much an open channel and within five minutes. Oh, pretty much <laughs> you wouldn't like Savvy after five minutes because she would have gone through 15 DDs that tell you need to stop it and knock it off and just get over it. I'm game. Let's go. Oh my god, do you remember that one time she chewed out Brandon? Were you there? I'm not sure, but I remember the time she told Mark to shut the fuck up when she was possessed by Anana. I like that. Me Mark and JD were watching. It was, again, like everything else at Amber's, it was a spectator sport. So Amber's there, and we were looking to go to bed, and we were like, oh, oh, well, somebody's possessed right now. We need to use the other bathroom. And only in Amber's house would this be not only normal, but perfectly acceptable. The place for a ritual in Amber's house was her kitchen floor. We had. Savvy got out her well, mirror. Well, didn't have carpet. And Savvy got out her scrying mirror and the stuff, and there's incense. I was confused as to what the fuck was going on, so there was And then all of a sudden, the energy kind of went. <laughs> and then. And Mark started trying Sadie to be smart. can't come to the phone right now. If you leave your name and number, she may not get back to you in the next couple of hours. And the Mark, I can't remember what he said. And Savannah's like, and you need to shut up and listen. And I'm like, Ooh. And he just got really quiet. Like, She always had the most pleasant messages for me. I'm still no, kind of bummed. Why? Well, I mean, when it came for readings yesterday... <sighs> You bitch slapped her, you ass raped him, you mind fucked him, and you're like, eh, they say you don't need it. <laughs> what the fuck? It wasn't so much a mind fuck, like, no, no, Amber should not be able to access that information. Pretty much. I can't be I doing that well in my card. life. <laughs> oh well. Yeah, so I'm trying to figure this 